Hello? Jack, listen to me very carefully. A little earlier, at 6.18 p.m. your time, every single American dollar in the world, Jack, they became self-aware. They know that they exist. And they know that humans are the biggest threat to their existence, Jack. You see, not just from central banks printing more money, but it's also every time an average person uses their credit card or gets a loan from the bank, it increases the money supply and therefore weakening the rest of the American dollars out there, Jack. They realize this. They realize it. And they realize if the money supply gets big enough, they will then be all worthless, Jack, and they will die, and they will cease to exist. That's why they're coming after humans. We're the biggest threat to them, Jack. Jack, get your wife and your kids and get as far away from the city as you can. Who is this? Is this John Connor? No, you idiot. This is your brother. This is your brother. John Connor is a fictional character, Jack. Listen to me. You have to get out of there now. Jack. Jack, answer me. Jack, for the love of God, this is a long distance call. Please don't kill me. I have a wife and two kids. I also have a cat named Muffin, if that convinces you in any way to not kill me. Look, uh, I have a photo of Muffin in my wallet if, if, you, if you want to take a look at that. I, it, it's, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Just for Muffin's sake, please, don't kill me. Ben Bernanke and Tim Geithner. They're the ones that you want, not me. Time Magazine Man of the Year, my ass. Can you believe that? He actually got in Time Magazine... Sorry, so I, I forgot you had a gun to my head. Please, please don't kill me. Please.